Hello everyone, welcome to Climbing Hacks. Today I'm quite excited to show a device that I have been using for more than one year. And it's something that I, I even wonder why the guys from Edery didn't develop it themselves. It's something that is here to solve most of the, the main problems that I see and I hear in forums from Megaju. And uh, these problems are specifically the jerky rappelling that you have with Megaju the lowering problems that when you low, when you push the handle you have a free fall from the climber and also lowering from the anchor that you requires a specific carabiner that not everyone has or sometimes you're doing a multi-pitch and you don't have that carabiner with you. This is a 3D printed part which you can make it with nylon, PLA or ABS. If you don't have a 3D printer you can ask a friend that has a 3D printer to print for you and something very nice about it is that you don't really have to worry about safety because if this device breaks, if this uh, material is not strong enough, the system just goes back to locked state. So uh, I have these two videos of me and my girlfriend exemplifying how it works. One with a Megaju, the other one with a Megaju Sport. And as you can see, all you need to do is to use your thumb to press this small plastic handle and then the climber starts to lower. Of course, you keep your hand on the dead rope, but you don't have to worry about grabbing it as uh, the unlocking of the system is happening with your thumb pressing down. And you can even use your uh, index finger to swivel the device. To me, Megaju is the kind of device that is supposed to be a Grigri killer. Everything you can do with a Grigri, you can equally do with a Megaju, but you cannot uh, rappel on two strands on a Grigri. And uh, with a Grigri, you also cannot guide belay with uh, two strands. You cannot pull two seconds when you reach the top. Um, I really believe that there are other things that Edelried could do to improve the Megaju. I think that this device has a bright future. And the Gigaju is a great device, but you add weight to it. But I think that the Megaju could be polished to reach better performances, to have uh, better handling of ropes, uh, independent of diameter, actually. It's, there are small changes that you can make on it. In guide mode, the lowering mechanism is going to work with a quick draw, which is something that every time you reach the top of a multi-pitch, you will probably have a quick draw with you, or maybe a carabiner. You can also pull it from a carabiner. You will use this small eyelet that I created on the handle, underneath the handle of the Megaju, and you can just use your hand on the anchor to leverage yourself and pull the system to unlock. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for watching the video and I hope you enjoyed.